Hey, what's happening guys? Mike Moo here. There's a quick question about how you undelete photos. If you just recently deleted photos or if you deleted it within the past couple of weeks, how do you get it back? Luckily, a lot of people don't know this, but actually for the iPhone, uh, if you just click on the photos and I'm going to go ahead and record this so you can see if you click on the photos and basically, uh, there is a wastebasket trash can that is in there. Click on the photos. Uh, if you click on albums on the bottom, scroll down to the very, very bottom. There's a section called other albums. It'll have imports. It'll have hidden and it'll have recently deleted. All you have to do is click on recently deleted, pick the ones that you want. You can select multiple of them by just clicking on a select and just click, 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 click on any of the ones that you want to um, undelete. And even if you notice on the bottom of some of these images too, it'll let you know roughly how many days left before it's permanent deleted. So the iPhone will automatically delete these out of your waste bin after 30 to 40 days. Some of it kind of depends on what iOS version you're on and also how much space you have left on your iPhone. So if you go ahead and do that, you can go ahead and recover. And uh, the buttons on the bottom right hand side, just click on recover. If you want to delete it permanently, let's say you really, really meant to delete it. You just have to click the ones that you wanted to delete and uh, just click on delete on the bottom left hand side and that should do it. Okay. And it'll, it'll ask you for confirmation again. Now, if you want to recover, of course, that's how you do it. It's on, on the selection on the right. Make sure you're sure about what you're going to do about this, because some of you, if you don't pay for iCloud, which is an additional service, um, it will let you know that right here, your iCloud settings, it'll let you know whether or not things are being backed up or not. And if you don't pay for iCloud, you run out of space on it. Once you delete it from your iPhone, it's pretty much gone forever unless you're willing to pay a really, 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 really high price, really high price in order to get that stuff back. All right. Hopefully that was useful to you. Please give this a like and subscribe for more tips and videos like this. Thanks for watching.